If you or someone you love has e ever been the victim of a crime in Greater Victoria, you may have been helped through the trauma with support of volunteers from Victim Services. But there's many more of us that this important service is now reaching out to. Here's V. Cooper to explain. September 4th, 2007, a horrific murder-suicide leaves five dead in a quiet Oak Bay neighborhood. Uh, that was huge for us. We opened like 23 files on that one incident. 23 files, not about the murders, but for those traumatically impacted by this horrific event. There was a family who had five children who were not knowing how to tell their children what had happened. And so they asked us to come home with them. And that is the kind of work the remarkable volunteers from Victim Services are doing every day. What we're there for is to try to bring them back to normal again after they've been through a traumatic experience or find a new normal. We had a scenario uh, last week where a young woman completed suicide in Bastion Square. And there were people who watched helplessly. They saw her on the roof, they saw her about to jump, and they saw her jump. And it was amazing for me to see how we were able to be there for her family, her loved ones, and the witnesses as well. Since 1983, Greater Victoria Police Victim Services has provided emotional and practical support for victims of crime and trauma. But there's many kinds of crime. If they're asking you for a password, for instance, the government doesn't ask you for your password, ever. Victim Services wants to let Greater Victoria know they are here for all of us. This is the first of many upcoming seminars, and this one is for a very vulnerable segment of our population, our seniors. They told her to go to her bank and withdraw an amount of money, which she did, meet her at a parking lot, and she handed the money over in an envelope, and they said, now don't look back. I think we are more vulnerable as we get older. I'm 90, and I tend to kind of, um, I guess, believe people when they phone because I'm honest myself. I thought it was something that if you got beat up, it, they, you know, you were being looked after. In case something were to happen, now I know where to go. I've got the numbers. People have the right to have the knowledgeable kind of emotional support that we can give them. Log on to gvpvs.org for upcoming information sessions. Vital People is brought to you by the Victoria Foundation, connecting people who care with causes that matter.